What is going on everybody? Day three, third and final day of the Spring King Pompano Tournament. Water's looking great this morning. A little calm out there. Hopefully it's gonna pick up a little bit for us. Um, if you haven't seen day two yet, I'm gonna go ahead and link it up here. Y'all go check out that video first. We're on the board with some decent pompano, but I still need to get a couple big ones today uh, so we can try to place. Salty's probably gonna win that big fish. He got a big one on the first day. Um, we're gonna see what we can get into today. Hope y'all enjoy it. Ugh. Still there? Yeah, it's not small. Hey, 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 Chris. That's not that small. See what we got here. They're coming through, they're coming through. Got a little pump here. Little bitty fella. So we got. We were doubled up on pumps, but one got off. We got one. Here's a little bigger. Did you lose a hook? Damn it, that one behind it was bigger. Did you see him jump out of the water? Yeah. There we go, fish on. That's definitely a pop. Come on, baby. Be the good one we're after. Be the good one. Hey, your dolphin's out there. Come on. Get up here. Your dolphins are going crazy out there now. Come on. See them all? Ah, oh, son of a. Got another one on here. Oh, that was yours. Sorry, I thought this was my rod. <laughs> Swimming in. Get over here, buddy. That's definitely a pump. Yeah. Self-releasing. All right, he's 12. Yeah. Got us a school coming through. Uh, he's got a catfish. This feels like a pompano though. Maybe. Might be a cat. Yep. Stupid catfish. I don't think that's a pompano. Yeah, I think it just got off. That's something hit this rod pretty good. It has been slow for a while. It'd be nice to see a pompano. Feels pompy. Hey, there's more. There's another over there. If you got a jig, there's some more over there. Uh, not tied on, no. Get your jig. 
jig. There's a school follow him. There we go. He had a school falling behind him. Oh, it's a good sight to see after a while not catching anything. Oh, jumping, jumping. Come on. Get up here. They are coming through now. Come on, baby. I need a big one. They here. Ready? All right. Thank you all for coming out to the grand finale of the Spring King Papano Tournament. We had, I believe, nine or ten competitors this year. We were going to have about fourteen, but you know, due to the COVID stuff, it threw us back. Our schedule's back, as you all know. So let's, let's quickly get them to who, tell them who they are. Let's do it. Start with you, Kyle. Okay. Just say who you are. Kyle for a while. Woo. All right. We're going to do the adventures. Southern Roots. Southern Roots. Fish gum. Yeah. Fish gum. This is right here. It's right here. <laughs> Mad, dog. Mad dog. I'm Luke with Crazy Croc Fishing. Bearded Brad. Nice. Dalton McCrory Fishing. Fish gum. Tell me who you are, man. Cash Assassin. Cash Assassin. Assassin. Bill Hollinsworth. Bill Hollinsworth. Yeah. Yeah. We all competed in the tournament. Um, just to review, the rules were the aggregate of the best three fish over three days Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And uh, first place will receive the fishing cart with the rod holders. Who's the one who made this week? Where'd you go? Right here, real quick. Just explain what, what you made and what people can get and who you are and how they can get one. Hi right, guys, I'm, I'm Colby Collins, uh, Beach Power Maryland Manufacturing. Here's a, uh, it's a, a bigger fishing cart. It's a lot heavier duty. It's got 16 inch by 8 inch tires on it. Um, we got a longer handle. We also got the big cutting stations. These uh, sand spike holders. Um, the quarter inch are a lot more heavy duty than the, the usual ones. We also got the, uh, the LED light slash camera holder. Uh, however you'd like it, it's also uh, removable. Um, and we also got our expanded metal bottom so that way um, everyone's stuff doesn't fall through. Awesome, it's awesome. Nice. The very best Sweet. I've ever seen. Any phone number to call you? Um, yeah, you can call me at 573-795-1970. Uh, awesome. We'll write that information, too, and, and, and put it in the caption of this card. Yeah, yeah. I appreciate it, brother. We'll all put a link to it, too. Thank Fantastic you. Fantastic piece of work here, guys. If you need to look this over, um, give, it, give it a video, too. You know, video it, too, because uh, you know, we'll talk about it in yeah. a second. And then these rod holders, th he was telling me that you get those for, like, 20 bucks. So nice. definitely worth it. You're not going to find a better deal anywhere. Also, you can do some custom work. We can talk about that later. Uh, the surf rod, uh, Brad or Salty, you guys know about this to be able to talk about it? Enough? Frisky fans. Frisky fans. You probably know more than I do. I, I don't know the blank or anything. Did you use it today? I did not. No, okay. no one's used it. Um, okay. I'm not sure the blank that he used, but it's either, I know he said either Lama, gas, Lama Glass or Rain Shadow. But it's 11 foot. Um, two piece. Two piece. Um, I've got a Cobia rod. I got one as well. Rod. You know, it's real good quality. This is Frisky Fans out of um, Artisan. Yep. That does them. Uh, he comes down, I think he's putting in rods at Gulf Breeze, Bait and Tackle. Yeah. And then he does lots of different custom rods, whatever you could want. Sweet. These are probably some of the coolest rods I've laid my hands on. Yeah, so. I, can't, I, I want to get a feel on it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, it's got a real good action on it. Them when I fish yeah. with them, they're very, yeah, they're very nice. Awesome. 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 Tony, can you talk about the camera? Sure, yeah, go fish cam. Um, if you're a YouTuber, you know how important your camera is. And if uh, you want to make a little extra money being a YouTuber, then you start sinking the go fish cam down to the bottom of the ocean and get some crazy footage and post it on YouTube and get a bunch of views. So yeah. we thank go fish cam for giving us this camera. Uh, it's awesome, it's high definition, and you're gonna get some good memories. That's right. right. You, you put out some sick videos. I know, man. That. You learn so much by just seeing what they're doing. Yeah. Awesome. This is an exact design sand flea rig. 
They have the custom curved handle, which helps you not to have to bend over as far, especially as tall guys. It has the teeth. I love this thing. This is an exact replica of what I have. Um, they sent to me. Great for digging up your samples in the sand. You can harvest hundreds really fast. So this is also one of our prizes today. And then Brad, can you talk about the rod runner? Hey, hold up. This is their large one. They got one with three, one with five. So this has got five rods in here. It's got two legs that clip in back here. You can go ahead. I use it when we go to fish the jetties. It says it right on the jetties, holds all your rods and everything. It's pretty awesome if you're doing a quick trip out to the beach or something, don't want to haul all this. This thing's awesome to be able to carry your rods down with you. And we can say it's a step up from the prizes last year. Yes. Even though I, I, I fish right. the Crayola markers and I got your nice trophy. The right. final prize, the, 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 the one everybody wants to get yes. is Pompano. First yes. place, the Spring King Pompano Tournament Trophy. Uh, we made something that you guys would be proud to hang in your house. Um, we figured uh, in middle school you kind of got over the whole trophy era. So we want to give you something that you can, respectable you can hang in your garage, your house, your shop. So this is a custom made metal um, Pompano two layer 3D. So that was, um, I'm trying to remember off the top of my head, I'll put them in the video description as well. It's a custom metal one two shop. Okay, so first place we'll receive the trophy, the cart, and the rod holders. Second place, um, we said uh, would receive the sampling rake and the camera. Third place, the rod runner and big fish prize will go um, with the uh, custom rod. Awesome. Okay, Mad Dog, can you help me with those numbers? Yep. We're gonna go um, from third to first. Yeah. And then we'll do big fish. Nice. Okay. Third place with the aggregate weight of 6.42 is Tony Baggioni. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Thank you, man. Good job, man. Appreciate you guys. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. That's awesome. Awesome job. Yeah, man. Thanks, Thank y'all. Thank y'all. It's awesome. Coming in second place with an aggregate weight of 7.15. Arrington. Yeah, Arrington. Yeah, let's go. Good job, brother. Good job. Good job. Nice work. I know. Congratulations. Sweet work, man. Sweet work. And then first place. <laughs> I'm just glad to have this one. <laughs> and in first place with an aggregate weight of 7.87, <laughs> the Salty McCrory. Woo! The yeah. Honored to present this to you. Go All right. Speech. This spent three days on the beach. <laughs> Full days. He probably fished the most out of any of us. Yeah. So let's give it up for Salty. Woo. Yeah. And it's to be no surprise, but the biggest weight of fish was also Salty. Salty. Three point five seven pounds to Salty. Good job, Salty. Yeah. Good job, man. Everyone. This is nice. This is sweet. Hey, I want to thank everybody that came out and did this, and Phil and Tony for putting it together. And I can't wait till we do one in the fall. Um, Ron and I were talking. I think that we got enough people that we could do, uh, if we wanted to, do like Alabama versus Florida. I think so. Oh. Yeah. And get and see. Yeah. It's all. Yeah, we want to <laughs> see what we can do. <laughs> well, we'll definitely brainstorm and we'll come up. I like the Florida versus Alabama mm -hmm. idea. We'll come up with a good tournament, maybe for the fall, so we can have a Spring King Pompano tournament and whatever we call the fall brawl or whatever. Yeah. So we'll do it. Okay, guys, I appreciate y'all coming out. Um, all right, y'all, hope y'all enjoyed that video on the way to the house now from the way in. Um, obviously wasn't able to make it in the top three, but still had a blast. Uh, got to meet a lot of other YouTubers that I haven't met yet. Um, got to see Salty's massive 3.57 fish, um, big pompano. Uh, but yeah, we had a great time. Hope y'all enjoyed all the video. We're gonna, sounds like we're going to be doing another uh, tournament this fall. Uh, I'm going to link everybody down below in the description, all the other YouTubers that participated in this. Y'all make sure to go check them out and subscribe to them as well. Everybody's got some really cool stuff. Uh, but anyways, until next time, y'all take care.